What's going on everyone? I hope you're having a great day. I wanted to take a little bit of time today to answer a subscriber question that I got on my Facebook fan page, and that was like a couple days back. Um, just, just so you know, anytime you message me on Facebook or really any, any social site, um, Facebook fan page is probably the best bet just because it's like the most organized to actually check those messages. Um, but you know, feel free to message me if you have any questions about anything really. I mean, if it's health or fitness related or even just life questions in general, I don't necessarily mind answering you know, questions about really anything. I mean, I actually have a, a pretty strong business background, um, you know, and, and in general, I just, I just apply logic to a lot of shit, you know, a lot of stuff you can actually really just work out and, and it's helpful to have someone else's perspective of, of, you know, your situation because it's an unbiased view of your situation. You know, when you think about your own situations and, and you overthink them and whatnot, you tend to get emotions involved and, um, you know, you, you won't necessarily come up with the greatest ideas. You won't have the most clearest ideas when you, when you, you know, it's your own problem because it's just difficult to do so. But when you get someone else involved, sometimes it might help. So anyways, I, I do tend to answer people's questions on my Facebook fan page. Um, a lot of intermittent fasting questions. So if you're watching this video and you're thinking about sending me one of those, just please check out my intermittent fasting video. I'll, I'll put it in the link in the description below. And, um, you know, because it answers a lot of that stuff. But I find that most of the questions that come in are about fasting and, and weight loss and dieting. So, um, you know, which is cool. No problem. I just, you know, I, I won't answer like all questions about fasting because, you know, it, it's, it's all there. The content's there anyway. So have a look at it, you know, watch that video and, and then go from there. Right. Check, check the comment section of that video, too, because I was very active uh, and made sure to reply to as many people as I could. So um, great, great resource anyways. Um, so let's get on to the question. Uh, here we go. So this is coming from a subscriber. I'm not going to say her name. Just you know, I, I don't want to, you know, give that give that away. But um, I'll tell you, she's French. She's from France. And uh, here we go. So it's been a few years now, and I'm struggling with my weight. I'm always trying to eat healthy and exercise, but I never really know what I should or shouldn't do. So I wish you could really help me. I'd like to improve my lifestyle, but all alone I can't do that. I always fail. I hope you will read this message and respond. Okay, well, I'm, I'm going to cut it off there. There's, there's more stuff, but that's all you really need to know. So let's call, see, I know her name, but let's call her, I don't know, Jane. Let's call you Jane. So um, I'm going to approach this from two different perspectives. I'm going to give you the uh, more in-depth answer to this, and then I'm going to give you a really simple answer as well. So let's start with the more in-depth one because I want you people to sit through this lengthy rant that I'm about to do. But, you know, hopefully I don't bore you too much. Um, what I want you to try to do is approach the healthy lifestyle um, and that healthy version of yourself from a different perspective. See, the, in your message you mentioned that you, you tend to always, you know, you try to eat healthy but you're not sure what you should and shouldn't do. Um, you know, and, and then you're even basically saying that once you do start to get on that train, once you do start to eat healthy and, and do all that stuff, you basically get to the point where you just stop or you fail or you don't, don't continue. So there's something I want you to try. And, you, you know, you can try this whenever. You can try this when you watch this video, actually, and you can, you can start doing it from then onward. But I want you to try creating some positive affirmations for yourself. And, you know, you're, you may be asking what's a positive affirmation. So I'll give you an example. If you wake up every morning and even before you go to bed at night, but every morning you wake up and you say to yourself something to the extent of, um, I'm so grateful to be healthy, happy, and vibrant. Uh, another one would be, I'm, I'm so thankful uh, to be healthy, vibrant, and beautiful. So you create these affirmations and, and you can repeat these things to yourself throughout the day. I recommend saying it when you wake up in the morning. Uh, even a good thing to do is go for a walk, go for a nice walk, you know, get, get your mind going, get your mind right. Go for a nice walk and say these affirmations to yourself. You can say them aloud. You don't necessarily have to, though. You can say them in your head. Do it before you go, go to bed and say it in your head then as well. These affirmations are they're imperative because when you, when you basically have the state of thinking that you are going to fail or that you, you know, you try, you've been trying things and you try things over and over again, but you always reach that sticking point or you hit a wall and then everything crumbles down. If you have that state of thinking, that will be what happens. That's the only, that's the simplest way I can put it. So when you create these affirmations for yourself, don't just say them. I, try to truly believe what you're saying. You know, put your heart into it. Don't just, don't just recite something and then just, you know, go about your regular routine. Try to truly feel what you're saying because you know what? Everything starts from within and works outwards. So if your thoughts are that you're healthy, happy, vibrant, beautiful, 
these are great positive affirmations that are going to help steer you in that direction um, you know with your dieting or whatever it may be with just just in the direction of a healthy happy active lifestyle and, and I've mentioned in previous videos before to hold that perfect version of yourself in your mind and you know that that perfect version is defined by you that perfect version is is something that you see yourself as you know it, no one else can can tell you what you should be or you know whatever whatever this, this is all just within so Creating these affirmations allows you to reinforce that and it allows you to really hold that perfect version of yourself, that, that healthy version of yourself that, that, you, that you see. And then you know what? You may find yourself not even questioning what you should or shouldn't do, what you should or shouldn't eat, whether you should exercise or whatnot. These things will start to come naturally to you. They'll start to flow naturally to you into your life just because you have that state of thinking. You know, you, again, get your mind right because that's really what's important. Um, beyond that, now getting into the actual health and fitness stuff, you know, maintaining a diet, you know, I use the word diet, I, I don't really like that word because honestly that word implies, to me it implies something that you can go on and off of, but really that's not what it's about. It's about just eating healthy and being aware, being like consciously aware of what you're consuming and what it's doing to you. Um, you know, a lot of people will tend to go on diets or they'll start eating healthy, you know, let's say you, you want to start being healthy right now and you're going to continue that. And let's say you hit a birthday party or something and someone's cutting a cake. I mean, if they offer you a slice, you sit there and you debate, well, I'm on my diet, I don't think I should eat this thing, yada, yada, yada. And you may end up taking that cake and that to you is your failure, right? See, the second you label that as a failure, that, that's what that becomes. And now you have an excuse to yourself to, to break down everything you've, you've tried to achieve up to that point. And you basically wake up the next day and you've thrown it all out the door. That's not the approach to have. When you, when you take a pizza slice of cake from someone, honestly, eat the, eat the fucking cake. Don't, don't, <laughs> I say that now, but like, don't let the cake destroy you. Don't let it destroy your state of thinking. Keep those positive affirmations. Have the slice of cake and enjoy the damn thing. I mean, don't let that hinder your ability to continue forward with your healthy habits, okay? That cake, you know what? Enjoy it for what it is and set it aside and say, you know what, that was really tasty, that was great, and you know, now it's back on, back on it. You know what I mean? Don't let something tear you down like that, because really it means nothing. It's, it's this small little intrinsic thing, you take it in and you digest it, and maybe you gain like half a pound or whatever, whatever, but really at the end of the day, it is, it's like nothing. These are all just external physical bullshit, right? So don't let that external physical bullshit get inside your head. Keep your affirmations, keep your positivity, and go forward with that. So that's the all-encompassing sort of more in-depth answer to your question. Now to keep things really simple, try to find people either online, there's lots of online communities, I mean shit, you, you messaged me, you, I'm doing this video, you, you're starting the process, it's great. Go on YouTube, talk to other people on YouTube, go on uh, Facebook, fan pages, find your motivation online in, in communities and through other people. Okay, you say you can't do it alone, right? You're never really alone now with the internet. You've got all these people that are willing to help you. You know, I'm, I'm here, I'm willing to help you. That's why I started my channel. It's not like for, to, for any other reason than to help people and to share my, my progress and my process. Um, so that's the simple answer. Get some people in your life that are gonna help influence that positivity, that are gonna help influence that, that healthy lifestyle that you want to achieve. And, and that's the simplest answer to it. So you know what, you've already started the process with this. You've already uh, started that simple you know, process. Now work on the, the, the first thing I mentioned. Work on your, your check, check your mind, get your mind right. You know what I mean? Like get, get all that in check. And uh, you know, I think you'll do just fine. So I hope that helps. Uh, again, if anyone has any questions, hit me up on my Facebook fan page. I'll put everything in the you know, description below, everything on the screen, all that good stuff. That's pretty much it. Have yourself a great day and take care.